hire this guy. I'll tweet this out. Yeah, why don't I go ahead and do that? Yeah, the artist retweeted you. Wait, really? Oh, he did. Thanks for the shout out. Wow, look at that. Holy shit, man. That is crazy. Wait, look at the Col Tiran. This is incredible. Holy shit. So imagine fighting that dude, man. And and what is this one? I guess Hunter? Damn. Those are actually really cool. Um, alright, so this is like the old druid one, I guess, with like the, uh, the Shadowlands almost transmog. This is, I'm assuming, a monk. And I don't know, I guess maybe this is the monk. And that is a mage, maybe? So, I think the coolest one here is obviously the hunter. Like, the hunter one looks way fucking cooler than all the other ones, in my opinion. So, I want to see what the human warriors look like. That's what I care about. No, uh, shoulders aren't big enough. Yeah, shoulders aren't big enough, man. Uh, I I'm not having it. Yeah, I, I don't think so, man. Let's see. That's for, I guess, paladins right there. I guess that's pretty cool. Yeah, the shoulders, again, are not big enough. The Death Knight one is really cool. This guy looks like, uh, what's his name? Yeah, I'm trying to remember. Yeah, Skeletor? Yeah, yeah, Skeletor, exactly. Okay, Gray Skull, not Gray Skull. All right, that's really cool. And uh, there's Hunter right there. Rogue. I guess that's a, uh, I don't know what that is. That looks really, really badass. This is probably the coolest one I've seen so far. And then this is, I guess, the priest one. That's really nice, too. Yeah, it's monk. Oh, right, of course, it must be monk. And then there's mage. That looks like a Final Fantasy mage, kind of. And there's a... Yo, that's cool. That's actually really fucking cool, dude. God damn, man. Wow, that is badass. Yeah, Mediv? Yeah, it's basically evil Mediv. Let me see what they have for, like, mecha, mecha gnomes. Man, like, I see this, right? And it's like, there's obviously a best one. Like, imagine that you're on, like, the character select screen, and it's like, choose your fighter. Imagine choosing the little stupid DK. Like, who the fuck wouldn't pick... Where is it? Who wouldn't pick this guy? He's fucking massive, and he's got another guy on top of him. Like, this guy's just, he's, he's the best one. Like, I mean, come on. It's its silly not to pick that. I, I like the monk one a lot. I think the monk one looks really, really cool. I don't know. What do you guys think? You guys like it? Look at Dark Iron? I, I'll look at that, too. But, uh, yeah, I think the monk one looks awesome. Uh, where is it? There it is. Yeah. It, it's most, uh, most unique, I would say. All right, what about this one here? So, look at the Maghar. Wait, so the orc is literally just black hand. So you've got black- these are pretty much just like orcs. This is Blackhand, Duratan, Ner'zhul, and is that- oh, that's Kilrog Deadeye. Yeah, these are pretty cool. Like, imagine if you were able to get Blackhand's armor, dude. That'd be fucking awesome. Uh, I would love to get that. Look at, uh, Void Elf. Yeah, I think Void Elves would be really cool. Oh, uh, yeah, I guess they are all the different clans. Yeah, so that's the Thunderlords. That's the, um, uh, the purple guys. Uh, that's the Skull Ones. This guy's pretty cool, too. I like I like the uh, the ring of skulls around him. And uh, that's the Shadow uh, Shadow Moon clan. Obviously, the Ner'zhul set. And then, I guess that's the um, the Bleeding Hollow. This one, I think, is probably my favorite. I, I think in terms of, like, its uniqueness and everything about it, it's like a new way to look at, like, the uh, the the sets. I think this one's the coolest one. Check out the Blood, one, Blood Elf one. Okay, uh, let me look at that. Oh, wow. That's pretty cool. That is pretty cool. Uh, what do you guys think? I like it a lot, actually. It's a really nice looking, uh, nice looking armor set right there, man. Uh, looks really badass. Yeah, I'd agree. And you've got the Paladin one right there. The Paladin one's kind of stupid. It reminds me a lot of the actual Paladin armor in game. And then that's, I guess, that's the DK. Damn, dude. Like, I want to see these armor sets in game. Who the fuck said that Blizzard can't come up with new ideas? Like, I know this obviously isn't Blizzard, but what I'm saying is, like, they can come up with sets like this uh, for each class. This guy did it all by himself. He's one dude. 
Yeah, these are really, really cool. Half of these look like better shit that Blizzard puts out. Like, the, oh, compare these to the old ear sets. Jesus, man. This one's not, not as good, right? But, like, then, oh, the SF... Oh, with the helmet there. With the fiery phoenix helmet. That's badass. Way better? I don't think it's way better. I think Blizzard comes out with some really good sets, but... And then I guess that's a priest? All right, there's the, uh, mage, I'm assuming? He's got like a fucking, he's got his bare chest out, man. He's like, yeah, look at that, dude. Ooh, hoo, 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 you know? Uh, that's great, man. That's a fucking really, really deep V-neck. That's a U-neck, actually. Uh, I, I like this one probably, I don't know, which one do I like the most? Um, I like the DK one the most. I think the DK one is really, really cool. Okay, what about, uh, let me look at Dark Iron. I'm actually most interested in seeing those. I knew it, dude. Holy fuck, bro. Look at the shaman. He's Ragnaros's little brother. Oh my god. And, and the the warrior here. Look at this. This guy's like a fucking cyborg. It's badass. I like this a lot. That's Sarkaris. I don't know about that. But like, look at that. That's the warrior one. That's the paladin one right there. That looks really cool. Like, I love the helmet. And uh, there's the shaman. I'm assuming. Yeah, it's got to be shaman. And. Wait, is that Shaman? Let me double check. Uh, yeah, that's Shaman. And then Hunter right there. And Rogue. I'm not really a big fan of the Rogue one. The Monk ones are always dumb. And, uh, let's look at... I, I like Priest and Mage the most. Actually, well, I like the Shaman one the most, but I like this one too. Okay. Yeah, there's the Priest set right there. I like this a lot. This is really, really cool. Uh, and so I like how it's a robe, but the robe looks like it's made out of steel. And, and then there's the mage one, too. Yeah, these look really, really badass. Like, this one here, like, I, I think some people like it. I, I don't like the helmet. I like everything else besides that, but I, I don't like the helmet, because I don't really think that it fits as well. But I think that it's deliberately not supposed to fit, because it's supposed to be a warlock, and warlocks do things that are, like, outside of what they're supposed to. So, it, it kind of makes sense. Look at Nightborn. Nightborn. Alright, let's see this. What the fuck? So, th that's like the, um, the Maldraxxus cloak. Uh, the tier 2 one? The Maldraxxus tier 2 cloak? But it's in the front instead of the back. Yeah, that's really cool. Uh, I guess that must be Hunter. Um, let's see, uh, that's Monk. I'm assuming this is Mage. I like this one a lot. This one actually does look like a perfect Nightborn set. I'm not a big fan of Nightborn. I always thought they were stupid. But, um, oh wow. Yo, these two right here? What the fuck, dude? What the fuck, dude? Wow. This is really, really cool. So that's obviously the Warlock, and that's pretty clearly the Mage. This, yeah, this is like an Elison set. I, I like this a lot. Like, giving characters and giving players, like, really cool sets like this, I think is, like, super important in the game. And uh, it just makes you feel good about playing your character and looking cool. And uh, let's see, where are some of the other ones? All right, Void Elves. I think you can come up with some good things for Void Elves, too. What the fuck? These look like action figures. So that's the warrior? God damn, man. God damn. Look at that. And then you've got... Is that the DK? Holy fuck. Let me actually... I can scroll down like this. I think this is probably a better way to do it. So there's the warrior one. Uh, I want to make sure it actually fits on screen for you guys. Yeah, it does. Okay. Okay. Um, let me just go ahead and go back over. So that's the, the- oh, it's Hunter. This is Hunter. Wow. And he has, like, a rationalization for, like, why he made it e each one different, right? For the ranger, I wanted to make something akin to a ranger, but with a twist of its own. What if instead of a quiver, they use the void to create arrows from nothing? Oh, like the, uh, like Thordile. And then there's rogues right there. And he's got, like, the little celestial face guard. That's really, really cool. All right, what about this one here? This is a monk? This is a monk? What the fuck, dude? What the fuck, dude? All right, yeah, this is like a corrupted monk, man. I, I love this. Like, this is, it's a new aesthetic that we haven't seen before, and I, I love, as I said, I just love seeing new things. Uh, that's my, uh, 
my favorite thing about it. Like, look at this. What about this one here? Is this Priest? Yeah. Uh, influenced by the Void Colors and one of the first Void Elf items in the files, a Lantern offhand, I decided to make Lanterns a design element for this class. Damn! Look at that. Uh, I'm not a big fan of the face mask. Uh, I don't really like that a whole lot. But everything else about it, I like a lot. It, it fits really well together. What about this one here? And this is a uh, mage. Damn. I guess this is what Kael'thas is going to look like after we kill him in Shadowlands and he comes back two expansions later again. Holy fuck, man. This looks really good. Yeah, dark Kael'thas, exactly. Uh, check out the orc. Yeah, I'll look at the orc ones too. And this is what? This is the warlock? The Warlock is meant to be the most liberal user of Void Energy displayed by the Void Tendencies grasping from his shoulder pads onto our reality. Fuck, dude. That's intense. That's, that's real intense. What the hell? Okay, Undead Warrior looks the best. I'll look at that in a bit. Um, okay, Warlock SFX mock-up. Oh! Oh, that's the way that it would move. Okay, that is really cool. Alright, let me see here. The, the Undead one looks good? The Undead Armor? Uh, that's the Undead Warrior? I guess this looks okay. It's not really like my type of thing, but it's more subdued, you know, and I, I get that. Um, then you have the DK, obviously. DKs, I think, do look really fucking cool. It's hard not to make a DK, uh, an Undead DK, look cool. Uh, yep. Oh, wow. Dude, I, I love the fucking... This guy looks like Darth Sidious, man. Yeah, this is... Yeah, not Nathanos, dude. Nathanos is a bitch. This guy's like Darth Sidious. Yeah, this is really, really cool. Alright, what about this one here? Rogue? Oh, with like the, the gas mask on? Oh! So he has like poison vials all over him. Damn. That's really clever. Look at that. Look at that shit, dude. Plaguebringer? Yeah, exactly. I like it a lot. This is really, really well put together. Okay, what about this one here? Uh, we've got Monk. This guy almost looks like a pirate. Look at him, man. Yeah, I, I kind of like this. I'm not, like, a huge fan of this one, but, uh, I, I don't like Monk, so it's not really... It's not his fault. Uh, I, I like this a lot, though. Um, obviously, like, compared to some of his... Oh, what the fuck? This is the coolest one. This is the coolest fucking one, man. Like, this is really, really fucking badass. Yeah, this is some kind of fucking, like, Scourge Acolyte. It's got, I, I love, my favorite part about this is the faces that are on the shoulder pads. That is the coolest part about it. Wow. Yeah, this makes me want to play a priest. I don't blame you, man. Uh, I don't blame you at all. Holy shit, it's you in a dress. Yeah, almost. Uh, yeah, I like the eye. I love this fucking mage set. This is badass. I, I think, honestly, like, I like it whenever, uh, whenever artists use different types of, like, um, different types of fantasy armor that aren't just traditional, you know, forms of, like, uh, European armor, right? They use things that kind of have, like, Egyptian references and, you know, kind of like, like, Middle Eastern type armor and stuff like that. Uh, I like seeing the whole, like, spectrum of the different armor sets and, like, mythologies used in fantasy games. And not just the European stuff. Uh, like, this kind of reminds me, obviously, of, like, um, I don't know, like, imagine, like, a, a, a priest of Anubis or something like that in, like, uh, Egyptian mythology. Uh, this is really cool. Reference to the witch model? Yeah, well, he's halfway there. Okay, let's go to the next one. Um, Warlock. They've made a few sets that are almost like this, but, uh, not quite like it. Yeah, this is really, really nice. Plague Doctor? Yeah, exactly. The Goblins? Look at that! Look at the Priest, man! So that's the Warrior Goblin, okay? Here's the facts, guys. Is, like, Warriors as Goblins... I, I mean, how are you really gonna have, like, a Warrior Goblin? You know what I mean? It just doesn't really make a whole lot of sense, dude. Yeah, it doesn't make a whole lot of sense. Like, yeah, just kick him away. Get, get him out of here. Don't have time for that. And then you've got that one right there, the football variant. This guy's basically uh, a, a little bit cooler. And so he's basically a football player. He's like the junior varsity. And we've got this guy here, Death Knight.
This is really creative. Like, this is actually... This is really creative. And really well done. I love this. Like, I, I like how what he's doing is he's actually taking full advantage of what the fantasy is, rather than feeling constricted by what the game's current armor is like. And I think that's really why so many of these sets are actually so interesting and cool to look at, is because they don't follow the same paradigms that we usually see with the sets. Now, uh, 40k? Yeah, maybe. And this is the Tinker, obviously. Um, look, man, I think that the other one was way cooler. But uh, I, I guess this would be really cool, too. I'd like to see a Tinker class, but I'm not sure if really I'd like to see it like this, personally. Let me see here. Shaman. Hmm. Shaman. What do you guys think? I, I, I'm, I'm very split on this one. What do you guys think about it? Did you showcase the Zandalari one? No, I didn't. Cool. Trash. I, I mean, I think it has like its own aesthetic to it. And I like how it's kind of like a binder in a way. And that's cool. But it's not necessarily uh, what, what I would ever pick. But I like that it exists. Hunter. Um... This actually, reminds, yeah, this is good because goblins, what the goblins hunt with? Bombs. They hunt with bombs. And he's got a bunch of fucking bombs. Uh, I like that again. Yeah, it's the uh, the old theme of uh, what really are goblins, right? And he's got like little eye patch on him too with like a little scope probably on it. That's really cool too. And then there's the rogue. Uh, I don't know about the clompers on the rogue, but um, I, I, I don't know, dude. Like the rogue is kind of cool, I guess. Uh, it's not really a big one for me, personally. I don't like the hat, man. He's wearing a trucker hat. This is the coolest one. I mean, this is this is obviously the coolest one. Yeah. This is fucking badass. Okay, so, yeah, this is really, really well put together. And what about this one here, Mage? This reminds me a little bit of the Firelands uh, Shaman set. Uh, I, I don't know why. It's, I guess it's kind of like the red and, like, the, the yellow on it. But this is really, really nice, too. Like, how it has the lava tips on it. And uh, the, fire, the fire coming out of it, that's really, really cool, too. And uh, Thanos Club, yeah, he does. Oh, yeah, he does have a Thanos Club. Holy shit. And uh, what about this one here? Oh, my God. The Warlock? Bro, this guy only knows how to summon a succubus. Like, you just look at him, man. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> all he knows how to do is summon succubi. <laughs> this is really, really cool. I, I, I love it, because it's like, it, it's such a perfect, uh, a perfect combination. You have, like, this dude that's obviously a fucking pimp in, like, fucking all purple and, and fur, and he's a warlock. It, it, it's great. Okay, let me go back over, and uh, we'll look at a couple more. Uh, I'll look at High Mountain Torrent. I'm not really expecting a whole lot of these to be, like, super interesting. Um, I, I kind of like the Shaman one here. Uh, the Shaman one I do kind of like. Let me see. I'll scroll down these. There's, that's the Warrior one, uh, themed after the Blood Totem tribe. Oh, oh, he's theming them after different tribes. That's at least cool. So, okay, never mind. I actually... Go, so, no, the reason why I, uh... The reason why I didn't like it, I, I didn't realize. So, each one of these are are themed after different tribes of the, uh, of the High Mountain uh, clans. I like that a lot. Yeah, that's actually really, really cool. Based around Ichiro, as Scenarius blessed Hulu and High Mountain due to him saving Ichiro, I thought it would be a fitting the theme for the Druid set. Damn! And that's the moose, by the way. That's the moose. What the fuck? And uh, obviously the monk here, based on the drug bar, is the Stone Dark drug bar played the part in the United High Mountain Torn? Want to give him a little nod through one of the sets? Yeah, that is cool. Uh, I wasn't really a big fan of the drug bar, but uh, that's okay. Let's look at the other ones. Okay, what about... Let's see. All right, Orc. How about Orc? Wait, the DK. Holy shit, I, I, I don't even care. Look at that. All right, Warrior 1 obviously looks pretty cool. Uh, I, I like this, but let's go to DK. Holy shit, dude. Bro, I, I, here's what I want DKs to have. This right here. This is what I want DKs to look like in-game. Right here. That This is obviously Terran Gorfin, the first DK. But, like, this is what I want to see them look like. These, like, badass mounted, like, fucking evil specters. Like, look at this right here. That type of Death Knight. Uh, I like that a lot. Okay, let me go back over to what we were looking at. Yeah, so this is what the DK kind of reminds me of. Uh, and so I, I like that a lot. 
All right, uh, obviously, where's the next one? Let me go, oops, I did not mean to do that. I'll go back. Okay, Shaman, pretty much what you'd expect out of Shaman. Uh, this is an Orc Shaman. I mean, there it is. DKs are better casters than most. Yeah, they're awesome. Uh, hunters, uh, I think we've seen a lot of Hunter sets that look kind of like this too. Yeah, I like that a lot. Yeah, Warcraft 3 Hunter. Uh, yeah, ba yeah, wait, oh yeah, you're right. That is a Warcraft 3 Shaman. It's been a long time, guys. I've kind of forgotten. Uh, let's see, there's the Hunter set. And the rogue set, rogue sets, uh, it's not really too cool, but uh, I like the uh, the poison vials and the, the utility belt there. And uh, then you've got the uh, the blade mat. No, it's not called a monk, okay? This is a blade master, all right? This is a blade master who uses a two-handed katana, and he blade storms all the time, all right? Yeah, not a fucking monk, but if we have to go with that, fine. It's the closest thing that we can have. This looks really, really fucking badass. This is like Jubithos or something like that from Warcraft 3. Uh, and let's see, you have the mage there. Uh... Do you want to know, like, my, my, like, opinion? I don't think... I don't think... I don't think orcs should be mages. I think that they should just be able to be shamans. I don't know, I don't know, like, why, but, like, that's my, my opinion. I don't think that they should be able to be mages. It's just... It doesn't make sense to me. It's the same as, like, Torin paladins, like, kind of vaguely makes sense, because Torin... Torn ideology and like Paladin ideology dovetail a lot, but this? Oh man, I can't, I'm not having it, man. Uh, and Warlocks? I think Orcs can be Warlocks. You really, you really want to take that away from them, man? This fucking Dungeon Master execution or Transmog? This is fucking awesome. This is really fucking awesome. I like it a lot. Uh, Orcs were the first, uh, yeah, Orcs were the first Warlocks. I, I, yeah, as far as I know. And, and the, uh, the statues, like, you know, like, the statues that are right next to the Dark Portal, like, with the, uh, the guys holding the swords? Those were the original Death Knights, and they were meant to, like, intimidate people because of how, how like, scary they were. Uh, yeah, this is really, really cool. I think I like the Warlock one the most. Uh, let's see. Yeah, I like the Warlock one the most. Obviously, the Monk one is really cool, but... I don't know, like, the Warlock and the DK one are, like, so close together. Uh, I, I probably like both of them equally. The Warrior one reminds me a lot of the, uh, High Warlord gear. Okay, um, let's see. Lightforge, I'll scroll through these real quick. Um, you got the warrior right there, that's cool. Uh, Iridar are the first warlocks? Really? Uh, I, I guess, yeah, you must be right, because Iridar predate, uh, orcs a lot. But, yeah, I guess so. Um, this is a paladin? I like this a lot. It's got, like, the cloth helmet on and everything like that. Like, this... This really looks good, man. Uh, what the fuck, man? Normal Torrent? Uh, I don't know about, like, normal Torrent or anything like that, but this does look really, really fucking good. Okay, um, give me one second. Let me take a look at this. Yeah, that looks good. We've got Hunter right here. I like that. And then this is Priest. Um... What do you guys think about this one? I kind of like it. Yeah, I, I do kind of like it. It reminds me a little bit of, um... It reminds me of the way that I think, like, Archimon and Kill Jaden probably would have looked before Sargeras corrupted them. Which is cool, too. Yeah, pre yeah, pre-corruption Kill Jaden, exactly. And, uh, there's the mage right there. And, um... Uh, again, like, yeah, this looks pretty much like Kill Jaden again. And, uh, Night Elf? Yeah, kind of. Alright, let me go, uh... Oh, you want me to look at the Night Elf ones? Okay. Um, let me see. I'm gonna go through the Panda, Panda ones, Panda ones real quick. Okay, real quick on Panda ones. Oh, wait, there's an Alliance and Horde Panda set? Wait, bro, how can you fucking look at these, right? Look at this one. This is the Alliance one. And this is the Horde. Who the fuck wouldn't pick Horde? Like, I mean, the Horde ones are way cooler, man. This is the Alliance Warrior. Oh, give me a break, man. And that's the Horde Warrior? This is badass, dude. This is like a big, beefy Genghis Khan. This is like a fat lion. You know? I mean, come on, man. Then you've got the, uh, the Shamans right there. The Alliance Shaman. The Horde Shaman right there. I, I don't know about the helmet shoulders. It's a little bit awkward to me. Uh, Alliance Hunter. Look at that. It looks like a level 87, man. He just got done questing in Town Long Steps. And, uh, he's getting ready to go into Dread Wastes. Look at this guy. And then you got the, uh, the Horde Hunter, and this guy looks like a, um... He looks like a, I don't know, like an archer or something like that. I don't know, I, I like this a lot. 
Think you just like the darker color themes? Maybe I do, but uh, one way or another, I do like it a lot. Uh, this is really cool. Okay, let's see here. And then there's the Alliance Rogue, which is a, I guess it's a tiger or something? The Horde one, yeah, again, the Horde one looks way fucking cooler, man. Uh, yeah, a Mongol. Yeah, exactly. Uh, a Mongolian archer. That's what I was trying to think of. Um, holy shit, man. Alliance Monk and Horde Monk? Okay. And Alliance Priest? Okay, the Alliance Priest one is really cool. I, I really like the helmet. The helmet is fucking cool. The Horde Priest? I like this one a lot, too. It's hard to say which one I like more. Because the helmet just, the helmet kills it with this one here. The helmet kills it with this one. I love it. But, uh, yeah, obviously this guy is, you know, everybody says the Horse, Horde Shaw one is really cool, too. I, I see that. Uh, Alliance Mage right there. What's he gonna cast? Flowers on somebody? Jeez, dude. And then there's the, uh, Horde Mage as well. Okay. Yeah, we'll look at the Night Elves and we'll move on. Okay, so... Oh, a Warden set! So you have the ward Warrior set right there. Okay, that's cool. Worgen? Oh yeah, I will check the Worgen set. I think the Worgen sets could be really cool. Uh, cause you've never really seen like an actual like Worgen, uh, class set. So yeah, that's like the, uh, the Warrior set. This is the Death Knight set? What the fuck? This is awesome. Dude! Oh, dude, what the fuck? This is really, really nice. I like that a lot. God damn. Okay, alright, let's move on. And, uh, Xandari are the coolest. Okay, and then he- Oh, dude. Okay, dude. Okay, dude. This reminds me of the hunter that was in the original cinematic. Uh, in, like, Ashenvale. Yeah, this is great. And then, obviously, you have the Warden Rogue set. Uh, Warden sets are cool. And then you have the Druid set. Obviously, kind of like Malfurion, in a way. And, uh, almost like, uh, the Tier 1 with the helmet there, too. And, uh, the Monk set, too. Not really a big fan of Monks as, as general, you know, so it is what it is. And, uh, there's the Demon Hunter. Uh... I don't know about this one, man. Uh, I don't think this, like, fits the Demon Hunter aesthetic in, in my mind. I'm like, what would I imagine a Demon Hunter to look like? It, not necessarily this. But I think it's cool. And this is the Taronda set. Uh, and let's see, what about this one here? This is Priest, it's Mage. Okay. Yeah, I like the, um... I like the DK one the most, I think. Yeah, I like the DK one the most, and I think a lot of you guys probably like the Hunter one the most. So yeah, those are cool, too. Uh, Void Elf set. All right, we'll look at the Worgen one. Let me see, where is it? Um, oh, there it is. Wow. There's the Warrior one right there. Holy shit. He's got all the armor on. Holy fuck. Wow, okay. All right, let me see here. That's a... De oh, man. Oh, dude. Oh, dude. That is cool. That is really, really cool. I love this. All right, what about this one here? Death Knight Old? Yeah, this is definitely an improvement over this one. Yeah, this guy is like... <laughs> this guy's way cooler than this one. Uh, but uh, I think this is like a cool like little starter set, maybe. And then... Oh! You have the Witch Hunter! Look at that. It's pretty clear in Grey Man's Master's Gun. Here's the Storm Tremendous Just Right Design Decision for Oregon Hunters. Yeah, this is really nice. Uh, Witch Hunter? Yeah, clearly. Witch Hunter. Okay, what about this one here? Rogue. For Rogue, I want to experiment with asymmetry using the collection model system. Uh, primary design was the direction. Jack the Ripper? Holy shit. Okay, yeah, this is kind of cool, too. With, like, the, uh, almost mechanical arm and the, uh, the top hat, too. And, uh, yeah, the Bloodborne, uh, aesthetic, too. And the Druid, let's see, Druid find middle ground before Gilneas and Druidisms and could be worn by Gilnean Harvest Witches. Oh! Uh Okay, all right, I'll go with it. And uh, we'll have the mage and uh, the aristocrat aura to him. Okay, so the mage is supposed to look like really regal and cool. Uh, I, I like that. Okay, uh, let's see, where are the other ones here? Uh, you got the uh, priest. Uh, priest is kind of like whatever. I think that there's a setting game that almost looks just like that, actually. And then we have the warlock. I just, in general, like warlock sets a lot. I think my favorite out of these is, uh, it's the DK. Like, it's the DK, and then probably number two would be either Rogue or Hunter. It's hard for me to say which one. But the DK one is really, really cool. Uh, I like that a lot. All right. So, yeah, these are all really, really cool. Uh, I like what he's done with these. And um, I'd like to see, obviously, like, uh, Blizzard should hire this guy. 
Like, straight up. Blizzard should fucking hire this guy. These are badass. Like, all of these sets are really cool. You, I mean, you've got the Bob Salami Death Knight set. Look at that. That's the Warrior set. Not really that cool. Yeah, they, they definitely should. What the fuck, man? Yeah, this is badass. Post this guy on Twitter. Um, I don't know. Is this, like, getting a lot of attention? Let me see if it's getting a lot of attention. Yeah, he only has, like, 3k followers. Dude. Yeah. Let me do, let me do this, okay? I'll, I'll do a tweet. All right. Uh, hire this guy. Okay. All right, Blizzard hired this guy. Okay. Uh, where is this here? Uh, Warcraft devs. Uh, I'll just, uh, I'll just at Warcraft. I think that's a good idea. Doing the right thing. Yeah, I, I think that I'm doing the right thing. So anyway, uh, I'll go ahead and I'll, uh, I'll tweet this out. Yeah, why don't I go ahead and do that? Yeah, the artist retweeted you. Wait, really? Oh, he did! Thanks for the shout-out! Wow, look at that! Holy shit, man! That is crazy! That is actually fucking crazy! And, and really cool, too. It's awesome.